everyone, Carmen here, and you get to meet my mom. Hello. She's my um, partner, my Plexus partner, and we get to do stuff like this together. So today uh, we're going to be going over detox. Um, this is this is such an important topic. Every single time somebody comes to Plexus, we always send out a welcome email. And in that welcome email, we list detox symptoms and say that you may or may not experience these. Then somebody gets a minor headache or a stomach ache and they go, oh, this stuff's making me sick. I can't quit taking it. I'm like, no, you're just detoxing. It's actually a very, very good thing. Um, so what is detox? Okay, detox is your body's natural way of healing itself. Um, it's actually flushing out toxins, getting rid of candida yeast, getting rid of bad bacteria. Um, I went over in it. I went over this stuff when I was talking about the probi probiotic and the bio cleanse. I was talking about breaking up candida. That's what it's going in your body and doing. Okay, that stuff doesn't just magically disappear in your body. It is breaking up and it has to be released out of your body somehow, some way. And the way that it can do that is through your liver, um, through your skin, through your colon. Um, there's a number of different ways that toxins and candida yeast are going to break up and come out of your body. And there's all kinds of symptoms that um, Ah, that can happen <laughs> um, for anywhere from headaches to being a little nauseous to a little stomach cramp to maybe being even bloated you start taking this and you're like I'm trying to make my bloating go down all of a sudden I'm more bloated you might be a little bit more bloated at first you might have mm -hmm. sugar cravings you may even gain a little bit of weight and I know that sounds scary and that's not the direction we're going in but none of that is permanent. It's just your body's way of getting back to its natural state and trying to heal itself. Um, did I already say that we're very, very used to suppressing symptoms? Um, mm -hmm. we're, we're, you know, whenever we get something, we want to make it go away immediately. Take a pill, mm -hmm. make that headache go away immediately. Well, your body, did you know, okay, side note, did you know that when we, when our kids get a fever, it's their body's natural way of fighting off a cold? And what do we do? We suppress that. Okay, I won't even go there, but your body knows what it's doing. So detox is, be happy about it. Um, it's okay, it may last a week, two weeks, three weeks, um, but think long term because the other side of detox, you're gonna feel awesome, you're gonna have energy, you're gonna start losing weight, losing inches. Um, look at the light at the end of the tunnel. Don't just focus on, oh, I feel kind of crappy right now and I'm on day two and I'm gonna quit taking this stuff. Mm -hmm. um, so just know that it can happen. It didn't happen to me. I never went through detox, but I can rattle off a number of people, including my mom, who mm -hmm. actually did go through detox. So um, I'm going to let throw it over to her, and she's going to just explain to you really quickly in about a minute, minute and a half, kind of how she felt her very first month, uh, maybe month and a half, of taking Plexus. Well, when I first started, and I knew about the detox and all that, but um, my first month, I didn't really feel better at all. In fact, I felt worse my first month, and I did exactly what Carmen said. I wanted to stop. I thought, this is not working. I don't want to feel worse, and she said, no, Mom, mm -hmm. just keep taking it. You're going to feel better. My skin broke out, my chin broke out in these hideous, <laughs> hideous, um, it was more than pimples, it was terrible, <laughs> and I mean, it was gross, and I'm I like, keep taking it, <laughs> and she it's said, working. you're detoxing, and I'm like, yeah, oh, right. okay, uh, so I, you know, I do what my daughter says, so <laughs> I said, if I had bought it over the counter, I would have stopped taking it, if there was no one uh, egging me on to keep taking it I would have stopped and I'm so glad I didn't because by the second month I can't really honestly say I felt better but I was over all that really awful mm -hmm. stuff by the third month I actually felt good and better and I started losing inches and pounds and all that so 
it was a big hump to get over, but I'm very glad that I, I continued mm-hmm. and to, and my she, progress. She's mm-hmm. still on Plexus. She's been I doing am. it about a year now. I've been doing it was a year in April. So I've been I've been on it. And we look at long. and we look at pictures of both of us um, about a year and a half ago together and there's a clear difference mm-hmm. um, between there how we are look now. so many things that you know it's subtle changes because I always had sinus problems at which so many people here in Oklahoma do mm-hmm. and I suffered with that I mean almost ongoing I had a lot of bloating and gassiness I love popcorn, and when I would eat popcorn at night, the next morning I could, I could count on being crampy for a half a day. Now I don't, I don't suffer with that at all. I mean, it's kind of little things, but really it's not yeah. little because I don't suffer with it anymore. So it's it's big. Yeah, it's little things add up to big changes, mm-hmm. and that's what you want. Um, Okay, so we're going to cut this short. If you um, are experiencing any kind of symptoms like that, I'm going to list some out here. Just um, be excited. You're going Mm -hmm. through detox, and that's Mm -hmm. a good thing. So stick it out. Stick with it. And um, the question for the day is, what could be a good good question for them? Um, Um. One thing I was going to say, you know, a lot of times your detox symptoms are kind of a magnification of something that you're already suffering with. Mm -hmm. And so maybe there's something you're suffering with that might increase. And, you know, so that can be related. Maybe you might want to say, well, I want to get rid of this. I want to get rid of that. So... I don't know. I, I think the question of the, the day is, um, let us know. Just comment below. Do you feel like you're detoxing? If you are, let us know um, your detox s- symptoms. If you're not and you've already started feeling awesome and amazing, I want to hear about that too. I want to know, know how you're feeling right now. And maybe you're not feeling anything because honestly, it took me. I was running on this stuff for about a month and a half, two months, and I was just kind of like, hmm. I can't really tell anything. Everybody's different. Okay, so let us know below how you're feeling right now and if you're experiencing any of these symptoms and if all of this is a surprise to you. Okay, we will be back again tomorrow. Bye.